The city of Fresno had professional baseball as far back as 1898, when it had a team in the original California League, then considered an outlaw league. The team dropped out of the league after that year, but the California League returned in 1905 with the Fresno Tigers, joined late in the season by Fresno native and future Hall of Famer Frank Chance. In 1906, Fresno had its first Pacific Coast League team, the Fresno Raisin Eaters. The following years saw the city field teams such as the Raisin Growers and more Tigers. In 1910, Fresno rejoined the old California League, which had entered organized baseball as a Class D California State League, but the league folded during the season. Next, the city fielded teams like the Fresno Packers. When the league reorganized, Fresno rejoined it in 1913, finishing second in a four-team league. Fresno finished first in 1914, after which the team and league folded again. Most of these teams played at what was called Recreation Park. When the modern California League was founded in 1941, the Fresno Cardinals were a charter member. The Cards finished first in their inaugural year. In 1942, they finished second in a season shortened by America's entry into World War II. The league suspended play for the 1943, 44, and 45 seasons. In 1946, the California League resumed operations and the Cardinals won pennants in 1948 and 1952. In 1955, the Cardinals fielded one of the best teams in the history of minor league baseball. Ranked the 79th best minor league team of all time by baseball historians Bill Weiss and Marshall Wright. The team won its last pendant in Fresno the following year, 1956. These Cardinal teams played at Cardinal Field in what was then called Fresno State College Park at the modern-day Fresno City College campus. In 1958, the team entered into a working agreement with the San Francisco Giants, who had moved from New York the previous winter and were then renamed the Fresno Giants. As a Class A team, the Fresno Giants won championships in 1964, 1968, 1974, 1985, and 1987. Then, in 1987, after the 46-year-old Euless Grandstand was condemned because of structural defects and the team lost its long working agreement with, with the San Francisco Giants, the team was sold. The Fresno Suns operated as a co-op with players supplied by several major league clubs. Without a working agreement, the baseball team operated independently as the Fresno Suns in 1988. But lacking an adequate park, the franchise was bought and moved. Fresno experienced 10 years without professional baseball until 1998 when Major League Baseball expanded. The system saw multiple shuffles which ended in the Tucson Toros moving to Fresno, giving Fresno its first PCL team since 1906, the Grizzlies. And from 1998 through 2001, those Grizzlies played at Pete Biden Field at California State University Fresno, before moving to downtown Fresno at Grizzly Stadium and eventually to Chansey Park. Now, we don't know what the future will bring, but we do know what the past has taught us. Baseball has been in Fresno since 1898. The legacy of Fresno baseball spans several team names, venues, iconic players, and affiliates. The Fresno Grizzlies represent a tradition, a region, and a way of life. The Fresno Grizzlies represent Fresno, Growlifornia, where champions are grown. So get ready for the Bear Flag Rebellion of 2015. Opening day is April 9th. And we'll see you there.